Hi world, this is Chatty Dad One coming at you. I want to talk with you tonight about surveillance drones. Part of DHS's plan to control us and to glean as much information on us as as much as they can get on the American people. We don't have no more, um, you know, no more Fourth Amendment rights of privacy. I'll put a link to these below, but they've got these drones now to where they are so high-tech this one here can power itself, recharge itself by sitting on that power line. You know, and they're developing more and more of these drones all the time. Here's a plane releasing dozens, if not hundreds, of drones from the air, from a larger craft. to glean information. This uh, drone crashed in New York City and people protested as, you know, they learned what DHS really thinks about the Fourth Amendment. They don't think about it at all. It's null and void to them. All for getting to know you. Got to get that information on these terrorists. But the drones that they have are so sophisticated. They're so technologically advanced. They have capabilities to kill. They have capabilities to injure and hurt people, maim people. I'm sure that most of them are equipped with microwave emitting technology. That's my answer to a predator drone. <laughs> but they just don't have them that fly, they have them that go in tunnels, go underground, Go in places that a human would have to crawl and squeeze into. They spend big bucks on these drones. And these drones go right along with these. These will accompany the drones. Or the drones will accompany these. Who exactly will DHS rescue with this? And what exactly are they going to learn from these drones? They're going to learn everything. This is the uh, no hesitation shooting <coughs> shooting posters that they're using now target practice but with these drones they'll be able to know if you target practice if you work out where you go where you shop who you see they'll learn what secrets you have They'll be able to learn whether you're growing more food than you need. They also have these for surveillance, new lamp posts. They can give commands and listen. Do all kinds of things. I did a video on that a while back about these new spy lights and they're going up everywhere 
Here's the tower erected in front of a Walmart. For what purpose? I don't know. Training, maybe? But these miniature drones, they're not part of the, the 30,000 drones. They're not part of them. 70,000 per unit for that one. Of course, they're going to be looking for, you know, people who are growing weed. People who, uh, go and meet with other people and shoot off a couple of rounds with their new handgun. They have underwater drones that swim like fish. There you go. I like this picture. <laughs> I mean, look at this. Look at these. This is not a normal bug. A normal bug does not have sensors on its head. Like that. This is a drone. I mean, they've gone so far as to have all kinds of drones. You, you name it, they've probably got one that looks like it. And they will accompany these troops right here. These troops will have the drones under their thumb to provide them as much information as they can glean from them. Because that's what they want right now is information. That's what they need is information. They need information for their plan to go off without a hitch. Some drones are equipped with missiles, super deadly weapons. Some aren't. They tell us that some of these small drones don't have the capability to have missiles and stuff. But that's not true. This one here has one. Same thing they're putting under this one. Here's some automated turret. Shotgun. It's a, you know, security system. Super high tech, super deadly. Accurate. And a lot of times, nobody there to pull the trigger. There's not a human there. It's run by a computer with a program. Shoot anything that moves. And believe me, it'll shoot. But in conjunction with the drones and this kind of stuff, and all these troops. we got to really get to know how to take these things out, identify them. They even have little toy drones, <laughs> I guess, to soften our kids up for it. But yeah, what better way to, to get into a spy on a place like this in, here in Miami? What better way? that to send one of those little bird drones in there to fly around, perch somewhere for a couple days, check him out. You can know all kinds of stuff about him. But anyway, that's what I wanted to show you guys. All these stuff about the drones, I'll put the links underneath on the stories. They're super sophisticated, high technology. And we need to pay attention 
to the things around us. I hope everybody's well. I hope everybody's having a good day. And please, exercise the rights that we have left that they allow us to exercise because they're going to do what they want believe me they do already never give up your guns it's the only thing that stands between us and total takeover and tyranny Buy all the ammo you can, if, where, when, and how you can. Prepare as much as you can. Because this is a lot of stuff to face. It's a lot of stuff we're going to be dealing with. And we got this on top of it. God bless. Good luck to us all. I hope everybody has a good day, a good night. This is Chatty Dad 1. Over and out.